Good morning, everybody. So yesterday I had to run into Walmart and while I was there, I saw this on the coffee aisle. It is the Donut Shop brand and it is nutty plus caramel flavor. So I'm gonna be trying this this morning. I'm excited. It looks like it's gonna be pretty good. I'm gonna be using my pumpkin creamer with it. So hopefully that's good together, we'll see. So if y'all have a favorite coffee brand, leave me a comment down below and let me know what's your favorite. Or not necessarily brand, but your favorite coffee flavor because you can buy different brands with the same flavor and it's not much different. So what's your favorite coffee flavor? Welcome back to the vlog, y'all. Today is Monday, October the 25th. We just got finished up with schoolwork. It's getting close to one o'clock here. Lunch today, when you look at it on that kind of, I can't concentrate. For lunch today, the kids just had some leftover mac and cheese, um, a sandwich, and some yogurt. That's what they did, and now they are outside. They're gonna play for a little bit because we have to leave here in a little bit. Actually, I have to leave about, about 1.15. I've gotta take Kylie to the orthodontist. She has to be there at two. And then Emily has an appointment at 2.30 to pick up her new glasses. So we have to be there by 2.30. I'm thinking we should be able to make it to both. I may be just a few minutes late to the eye appointment though, which is just picking up her glasses. It's not a checkup. So we should be good on that. Say hey, sweet girl. She's watching Everly spin the chair in circles. But I tried that new coffee this morning and it was so good. It's really close to the Folgers caramel drizzle flavor. So good, I loved it. <laughs> I hear you. Did you laugh? Are you laughing at and y'all i have been so tempted to decorate for christmas so tempted i don't know i just see so many people around me decorating and when i go into the stores it's all the christmas things and it's like making me want to decorate my phone's beeping but i'm trying to hold out to november i'm definitely gonna hold out to november i'm not gonna decorate in october but um it will be very soon i was watching one of our old videos and we actually decorated on november 7th last year so it'll probably be somewhere around that time if not earlier but i do want to mention real quick that today's video is a collab with jessica over at fields full house i'm sure most of you know jessica but if you don't she's also a large family mom she actually just had her 11th baby about two and a half three weeks ago so she's got a sweet little newborn um and she just shares all of her day in life vlogs homeschooling and recipes everybody's trying to lie down on me <laughs> um and she's actually one of my good friends she's actually came to our house before and our kids are good friends they text each other so we just love the field so make sure you're, after you watch this video you head over and check her video out i'm going to link her down in the description box below so that you can go find her if you've never watched it before i know you'll love her channel Huh? Is Drew your friend? Yeah. They got to no, come back. Drew is my friend. She calls him Drew Drew. She said, no, Drew Drew is my friend. They got to come to our house back in April, and all of our kids are just such good friends. And they're actually coming back to our house in January. I'm so excited about that. You love Drew Drew? Well, he's coming back to our house in January. Are you excited? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Who's your friend? Drew Drew. Drew Drew. Yeah. Where'd he go? At his home. He went at his home? He's gonna come back. He's gonna come back? Are you excited? Mm -hmm. <laughs> so when I went into Walmart last night, my main thing to get was socks, even though I picked up a couple of birthday gifts and some stocking stuffers, but everybody got fresh new socks for the fall and winter. So this is all the girls socks. Um, let's see, did Emily already take hers? No, Emily's just right here. And Josh already took his and started wearing them. So, but that's all of the girls. Pumpkin cold brew today. They made it perfect. Perfect. I love when there's so much foam in there. I'm 
Emily just got her new glasses. They look so cute on her. <laughs> All right, so we're back home now. We'll come outside for a little bit because it is a beautiful, beautiful day out here. We had a little bit of rain for like five minutes, I think. Like literally it rained just a few minutes. But I'm going to walk to the car real quick and grab my sunglasses because the sun is so bright out here the appointments went good Kylie's orthodontist appointment was like maybe 20 minutes it was quick um and she actually gets her braces off in January or February she came out of there smiling so big because she's had her braces since, since March 2019 the month and year Everly was born um so she gets them off in January February and then we left there and Emily had her pick up her glasses so that took literally five minutes we walked in and I took a straight bag to get her glasses adjusted them just a little bit and we're back home so that wasn't too bad I was kind of worried about trying to get both of them there within 30 minutes of each other but it worked out and of course the first thing they do when we get home is come out here to this play set and play for hours and hours they got the sign out of the garage that says hello spring I had on our front porch put it in there and then on this side over here their little window sill is decorated look at these sweet little mamas in here decorating their home what about you missy what you doing hmm? just you just swinging but anyway today is actually going or now it's going a lot smoother than it was earlier today it was kind of rough like all the kids for some reason not all the kids, my older girls, I'll, I'll leave them out of this. My little kids were in a bad mood. Everly was in a bad mood this morning from the time she woke up. She woke up, she was coming upstairs at like 6.30 this morning. And was just crying and I was asking her what was wrong. She didn't want to talk. So she was up for, upset for a while and then Natalie was upset. And then it was just one of those days, y'all. It was just one of those days. So I just got off the phone with Josh and we decided to make Monday night, pizza night tonight instead of Friday night. We don't do this Friday every week, but pizza Monday sounds good for tonight. That's for sure. But I've got to get to planning, y'all. I've got birthdays coming up like crazy. So Kylie's 16th birthday is coming up. Amy and Natalie's birthday is the same day. They're turning 7 and 4. Their birthdays are coming up all in November. Josh's birthday is in November. I've got some parties coming up. I'm trying to plan for that. Everly, where are we going? Take on your chicken. <laughs> Chicken, chicken. Say, say hey, chicken, chicken. I hate it. <laughs> he hate it. Well, we at least got two eggs today. <laughs> That's better than nothing what we've been getting. Y'all, it was literally just pouring so hard. I mean, like, it was pouring down rain. All of a sudden, it just stopped. I am here in Hobby Lobby parking lot because it's one of those days where Mom gets a little evening time by herself. So, all the kids are at home with Josh. And here's my empty van. <laughs> It's so quiet, and I've, oh no, y'all hear that? It sounds like it's starting again. I should have used my opportunity and got out of the car. Oh, but there is a beautiful rainbow over there. Can y'all see that? That is just so beautiful and vibrant. I love it. But anyway, I'm about to get out of the car and go in Hobby Lobby. I have been wanting to go and do all the Christmas decor shopping, which I'm not really buying a lot. I might buy a few pieces for our house this year because we're going to be decorating. Because we're going to be decorating probably early November. So I just want to go check it out, see what they've got. So I'm thankful for a little bit of time out, but I'm always, every time I come out and I don't have my kids with me, I miss them. Like I miss them like crazy. So he's definitely a good man. I'm thankful he allows me time out, which I say allow, but I mean, you know what I'm saying though. You know what I'm saying. Like he don't mind well, I come out and he takes care of all the things at home. So, thankful for that. I'm going to go in Hobby Lobby and I figured I would take y'all with me. Fifty percent off Christmas party and tableware stuff. So cute. Y'all, look at these popcorn buckets. They are so cute. They have this one. Tis the season for Christmas movies. That's so cute. <laughs> Oh my gosh, that's the cutest thing ever. My kids always ask me how many sleeps till everything. So they would love that, sleeps till Christmas.
Okay, so I'm out of Hobby Lobby now. It's getting kind of dark, so hopefully the lighting is good. But I'm going to show you the few things that I got. I had a couple things in my buggy that I put back because I didn't really need. Because I, I bought some stuff last year from Hobby Lobby when it was Christmas time. And I'm going to use, I'm going to go with the same thing, which is the Buffalo Check. So, technically, I didn't need a lot. I just added a couple of pieces of what I've already got. So, I'm going to show you what I got. So, the first thing I got is this little snowman. And it's got the buffalo check just like what I've got at home with this little LED candle inside of it. I just need to get batteries and I thought this would be so cute on my countertop. Um, so I got this which is so cute and y'all my kids like love popcorn so I had to get one of these popcorn buckets. This was originally $3.99 with 50% off made it only like a dollar and something. I probably should have got more than one but I figured one is good for now so I just got one of these little buckets it is just so cute and it's plenty of room so we could put like several bags of popcorn in that and just sit it in the floor for all the kids to eat out of so I got that all right so if y'all remember last year I bought um 10 stockings the first year ever I had made all of our stockings match even Josh and mine were the same okay so I didn't buy Millie one I was like pregnant with Millie at the time I probably should have went ahead and bought one for her because wouldn't you know it there's none in there so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take the stockings that we have now we have nine girls so we're just gonna give them all the buffalo check and I just bought two new ones which is the plain red and I figured Josh and myself would just have a different stocking color than all the girls so they can keep the buffalo check and we just have these solid red ones so I just got two of these and these were 50% off which made them I think $5.49 a piece and that's a lot cheaper than just going and buying 11 matching stockings again so the next thing I got is just this little black sign that says cozy. I have a little white shelf in my living room that I thought this would be so cute on. Like I said, not only was their table decor 50% off, all of their Christmas stuff was 50% off. I did not realize that. So it was $9.99, but I got it for 50% off. And then this, again, the Buffalo Check. Oops, upside down. And it says, Merry Christmas, y'all. This is going to kind of go on the white shelf too that I'm talking about. Um, and it was $9.99, but I got it for 50% off. And this is actually a stocking stuffer. Y'all are going to think this is so funny. My kids love the Barbies and all the Barbie accessories, especially my five-year-old Bethany. She loves accessories. I saw this little shopping buggy in there. It's not technically for Barbies, but oh my gosh, I'm going to put this in her stocking. I think she's going to have a fit over it. It's like, it's perfect for like Barbie size for her Barbies to go shopping. And it was only $2.99. So this is going to go in Bethany's stocking. And it was, where was that? It was in the birthday party supplies. And then I just got one of these little sponges. I love these little seasonal sponges. So I got one of those. I got Josh some kisses. That's his favorite candy is kisses. So I got him some of those. I got some tape. I was at the register and I just saw tape and I was like, oh, I'll get that. And the last thing I got um, is just this. I used to have one of these until it broke. Um, it's just a key ring. Car seat and a bag and all this stuff. It's easy to stick this around my arm to carry it and I lock my front door or to get in the car or whatever. So I really missed it when it broke. So I got me another one and this was only $4.99. That's it. That's my little Hobby Lobby shopping haul, my little one. Um, now I need to go to the grocery store because the girls need some things to pack for their lunch tomorrow. Plus I still have not got my produce and meat for the week. So I need to go get lettuce and grapes and banana peppers and some meat. So I'm gonna run to the grocery store and get that. And then I'm gonna go home for the night. But anyway, I thank y'all so much for hanging out with me again today. If you're new to my channel, hit that subscribe button down below. Give this video a thumbs up, and I'll talk to you in the comments. Bye.